Hello, and last time we defeated the horrid super killer monkey that chased us down. It might have been some kind of shape change monster or whatever. And we uh, hitched a secret ride uh, in a hood back to LA. Well, Izzy apparently fucked uh, some uh, star of hers, some favorite music star of hers. And Simon was too tired to write anything this day. So, let's continue. How are you feeling, Sammy? They have me on a trip or of something. I can't remember the name, but it makes me really, really sleepy even when I'm awake. The food here is so bad. Can you guys bring me something? I'll ask Izzy. I'm out of town right now. Oh? I thought you were working since you never uh, I never answer during the daytime. What are you go what are you doing? Heading back from Seattle forever. Oh, you mean Anise? I remember when we went uh, to Six Flags, she was nice. She did my hair, remember? How is she? She's good. She's doing good. She says hi. A new message from an unknown contact. Ooh, and adventure from Rizzy. Interesting. Unknown. You're live. Avoid Mount Shasta, Blue Gum, Yuba City, Sacramento, Caram Camarillo, Elk Grove, Stockton, anything with tinted windows. HOV lanes at night. Well, that's weird. Hey, I gotta talk. Good, I'm getting bored in this trunk. Though, it's almost my turn to drive. Stole a new car in Fish Lake, which, by the way, is the worst name for that lake. How long until you get back? And I killed an eight Frankie's Chihuahua. Aha, the title of this chapter revealed. Like eight more hours if I drive all night and... Well, I don't like Chihuahuas much. Ah, oh, Chihuahuas are cute. So it's Frankie's Chihuahua so good. Fuck Frankie. Well, is he already did fuck Frankie, so if you get my point. He was kind of annoying, but it was still really sad. I don't know how to handle this. Gotta live. Plus, Chihuahuas are annoying. I also feel really bad I keep calling in sick to the shelter. I might go down to the hospital just to let Sammy know I'm okay. Should I wait for you? Oh shit, was, as was saying, she wants us uh, to bring her some real food. Which, you know, much, much, yeah, must be a big deal because she would never ask us for food normally. Also, want to meet up ASAP? On the other hand, I'm not sure if, uh, if, if I'm safe to go around, so yeah. Hmm. Good idea. Later. Battery's dying. Be in touch when I near, near a charge. Or some new terrible thing happens. Hmm. Okay. I hear the words, world hissing past and the lights scattered, one either side like low stars. You're coming home. Come close. Fuck off. Or should I stay? No. Guard, you creepy. Really wondering if you're some into some incest shit or something right now. New network area. Buen Vinadidos. Uh, so this is Californian, I guess. Still in the trunk. 
Nah. Taxi and driving was I'm all fucked because I'm a fucking vampire and a rebel. Still, lounging around your rockstar bedroom. Nah, I went to see Sammy in the hospital. I had to pretend I was femme to get in at night. All that blood, all those blood plaques and me like... Mm, <laughs> Did you? No, I couldn't and I'm really hungry. Oh, that guy, Paul, I told you about from the shelter who was selling those uh, Mr. Mr. Bubble boxes. He died. Sucks. Regular died at least. Stroke. Yeah, I went down to Skid Row, almost wish I didn't. I was in, in the other guy's tent who was telling me about it uh, when a cop decided to do us uh, for blocking the sidewalk. I mean, Frankie can pay it. But it's stupid. It's hot here. Tents are too hot to sleep in. And everyone's out like, Izzy, we haven't seen you. Yeah, I also had another bad dream. Yeah. Well, that's uh, I guess the big background picture we have there. It looks a bit more uh, impressive. Oh, this, this might be the blonde person we saw before. Interesting. God, at least a couple of them are good looking. And none of them are us. Now, I um, remember something. I may not meet you uh, right away when we get to LA. They might be following me. Might just sleep in the trunk tomorrow. And yeah, and that is definitely true. We are, uh, well, that was the unknown message we got earlier. We are in some danger zones right now. Izzy woke me up in the middle of the night with a Tommy burger. Said you're home soon? Yeah, probably. Okay, what's better? No matter how far the floppy kitten dived down, she couldn't find the bottom. Or down and down went the floppy kitten. But the bottom still, the lake was further still. I like the second one. The down down is kind of poetic. There's one other butt in there. Yeah. Children's books are full of butts. They are just asses, an unknown person said. Well, yes, I just said that. How does he know? Who? Hmm. Still an unknown. Interesting how you can have conversation with unknown people on your phone. Not who. Not like those people are asses. Not like an insult. Like when we were not twins, if you were wondering, but everyone asks. We're not even related, thank God. We're walking past the movie theater and that tattoo girl and that with that tattoo girls. And you didn't realize I could see you in the parking lot staring in the security mirror. And you were staring at uh, our asses. I'm saying, they're just asses. Our asses. No pants. No need to stare. In pants. No need to stare. Damn. Everyone just sees from me so easily. I like big butts and I cannot lie. How did you get my number anyway? Strange person. It's, I guess it's a lady. Hollis's house. Hollis was old. Had old person habits like writing phone numbers on pieces of paper. Did you kill Hollis? No. Probably the cabals did that. I just found Hollis dead. Right before your friend Izzy. You warned me before. Yeah, that was me. Why? 
I think you're hot. Hmm. Well, I guess I like your ass, as we previously discussed. And I also don't think the voice I'm doing for you is probably correct, uh, given this conversation. I knew Hollis had a good taste, so when I heard Hollis had new offspring, I had to check out the new kid. How'd you know I'd go to Seattle? Honestly, just check your friend Izzy's uh, FB. Oh, that thing. I saw this Nick person had, picture, had a pic from you at some, from some barbecue party, so I looked in on him. I was too late. I apologize. Thanks. Not too hot. Uh, if you're not too heartbroken, you should come out and play with us. My friends saw people fighting in a dream. Your friend has some kind of rare, rare aspects. Can see things like your mom. That's why the cabal wants them. Like my mom. Yes, you didn't know? Explains a lot. She's a witch of the Tremere. That's one way uh, they have a fake idea of where you are. They're hoping you'll, you'll lead them to your friend. Uh, tr 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 what? clan that uses freaky blood magic since the dark ages. We thought there were some warlocks creeping around the neighborhood and we started following them and well we lost them but we uh we found you. Anyways your friends saw people fighting like this. I sent over that uh, kind of cool picture and there's fire in there. I don't like fire anymore. Oh, that's also right. And them. They look nasty. You better come out and help. This is crazy. Come over and we'll put you put on the immortal and have a blood orgy in the pool and then get ambushed by a city cult near the concrete wall. It'll be fun. Reese had a Pomeranian. What's your name? Jamie. Jamie. Oh, okay. Might be a gent after all. Does Hollis have any other friends like us in LA? A few. Come out and play and I'll introduce you to the ones who aren't bastards. Hmm, okay, fine. Thing then. I don't think hiding by the car is that subtle, so you can hide behind a wall and ambush them. Walls cover up very well. I'm curious if I can't look at a bigger picture of this. Uh... No, that's that picture. I guess uh, not. Okay then. It's hard to see this picture. Now you're thinking like a real dead people. Yeah. Why aren't you taking this seriously? I spent all night looking out for, for hardworking people to eat and all day sleeping in a vault. I need to have fun where I can. Big question is, should I change first because I'm wearing that well, wearing that uh, because uh, it's real good look. I'm trying to impress you, but on the other hand, maybe I can thwart fate through fashion-based avoidance strategies. IDK, I might have to actually shop. Where do we meet? 
Meat? We're standing right next to your stupid parking spots. Get out of here, the trunk, you loon. Well, we're well met up then, I guess. Where are you? Towns in Skid Row. I'm at the tents with Leroy at them and them. Okay, stay there. What's going on? Long story. Got into town. Met some people. Had a few laughs. Started making out. One got killed. Kind of a blur. They were following you, like you guessed? Yeah. I think they're trying to find you, though. Me? One was carrying a receipt with this painted on the back. Okay, that's uh, a curious symbol. Hmm. I copied it and left it there. Better not, uh, Miss Essence. Oh, I heard a whoosh. That's usually a bad sign. And the music stopping. But what if it was like their witch king? Like, what if it was important? Oh well. If we agonize over every weird thing, we'd never have the day off, right? Well, we should have agonized over that. We apparently died for from that. Maybe they use it for the weird freaky witch magic. So yeah, this time let's keep the uh, weird ancient occult symbol. Might be useful later, I guess. It looked important, so I kept it. Oh. And then mom responded to me. There's a hollow where you once were. Where have you gone? Oh, I guess this might be some kind of cloaking uh, symbol or something. But judging by that reply. It's because of your dreams. Just stay at Frankie's house for a bit. Be careful. We got three numbers from them. Hollis's other friends. Alfonso Mesgorius. Some punk with a face tattoo. Morgan Alderasi. Who's got a lot of a lot of credits in bad monster movies, and then fucking Avery's Isles, and the por the porn girl with the dick. Well, now I know where you where you've been dreaming of why you've been dreaming about this lot. Uh, why I've been dreaming about this lot. I see another painting. Maybe these? Hollis never mentioned knowing anyone in porn. Hollis also, also never mentioned being a thousand years old. And a locus of a arcane blood feud either. Fair? What you gonna do? Let's actually look at these pictures. Well, that's a nice one. Cool tattoos. Reminds me a bit of Nosferatu, honestly. Okay, back. Down. Ah, I wish I could scroll this far. Oh, I can scroll this faster. So that's much easier. Well, what, what are you gonna do? Hide in a hotel room. Text some of these people. Try to get anyone else. Try not to get anyone else killed. So I guess Jamie might be dead then at this point. Ah, Alfonso is one of these people. Can you feel the radiance of this love? Do not shrink from it. Ah, yes, and uh, we can start talking with Alfonso then, I guess. Which we will be doing next time. So, till then. <laughs>